from the Cruise Radio Studio in Jacksonville, Florida. This is Cruise Radio News with Doug Parker. Here's your Cruise News Briefs for Wednesday, April 7th, 2021. In an unexpected development, the Centers for Disease Control released a statement late Tuesday afternoon indicating that a resumption of cruising might be closer than any of us could have predicted. And it seems that this was done in response to a move made by Carnival Cruise Line. The information recently released by the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the CDC, uh, does not provide the clarity that we need to cruise in June or to proceed. Carnival brand ambassador John Heald there only hours after the cruise line announced that they would be canceling their June sailings and indicated that they might be considering sailing out of foreign ports, a move they've so far resisted. The CDC released a statement saying that the agency was committed to working with the cruise industry and seaport partners to resume cruising following a phase and approach outlined in the conditional sailing order. While that sounds pretty much like what the CDC has been saying for months, the second part was definitely unexpected. After indicating that they were committed to working with the industry, the statement ended by saying, and I quote, This goal aligns with the desire to resume passenger operations in the United States expressed by many major cruise ship operators and travelers, hopefully by midsummer with restricted revenue sailings. For the first time since the shutdown, the CDC seems to be indicating that we might see cruise ships sailing out of U.S. ports by this summer. And following Royal Caribbean's lead, Norwegian Cruise Line announced on Tuesday morning that they'll begin sailing outside of the U.S. starting in July with three cruise ships. Taking a phased in approach to redeployment, Norwegian Jade will sail the Greek Isles from Athens starting on July 25th. Norwegian Joy will be sailing seven-night Caribbean cruises from Montego Bay, Jamaica starting on August 7th. And Norwegian Jim will operate seven-night Caribbean sailings from Punta Cana in the DR starting on August 15th. These sailings are open to vaccinated guests. And cruise line stocks closed up on Tuesday and rose even more in after-hours trading. Carnival Corporation closed at 28.60, up 2%. Royal Caribbean also up 2% to 90.76, and Norwegian up 4.6% to 31.02. Breaking news and up-to-the-minute industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise Radio News. The proceeding was a production of Cruise Radio. For more accurate and dependable updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.